All right, Eric Braid, thank you so much. Now, why don't we chat about what's trending with Special K from 104.1 KRBE. Hey, guys. Hey, welcome. You? Thank you. Happy hump day. I Happy love it. Day. It's almost there. Uh, no, uh, I'm here to do some trending and keep up with his mustache game. <laughs> it's strong over here, it isn't is. it? It I is. Mean, some people love the mustache, okay? And I do. I am okay. not one of them, but it's for a good cause. Well, let me help you celebrate the holidays uh, on a diet. Weight Watchers are introducing some diet wine, guys. What? No. Yes, it's called uh, Sense. Like, it makes sense to drink this rather than regular wine if you're on a diet. Sense with a C? Mm hmm So what makes it diet wine? There are just fewer calories? There are only 85 calories per glass as compared to 120 in a regular bottle of wine. Now, it does have a little label on the back that says Weight Watchers, but you can pull it off before you go to your friend's house so you don't have to be embarrassed. Right. But it has less booze in it. So oh. I've got to drink two bottles to get to, I mean, I'm still consuming the same amount of calories. Exactly. <laughs> so it's 30% less, they say. Happy holidays on a diet. Mm -mm. Okay. Let's go to number two with Taylor at number two at Target. So many T's. So Taylor rolled up to Target, y'all. As in I Swift? I would die. Shut it. I now, would die. you know how she's in cahoots with Target, so she goes out to Target in Nashville and she takes all of these pictures with the fans, signs their albums, meets and greets, and acts like a regular human being. Wow, I that is love so cool. That. Did you two download the album, by the way? I was one of those on Friday morning last week. Downloaded love it. it. Love every song. the whole thing already. I'm fortunate to get to hear Taylor Swift every 20 minutes right on the radio. <laughs> So oh, but he's not bitter. <laughs> wow. Number one, guys, coming in as your, uh, let, what's, let, what do we call him? The sexiest man alive, Blake oh, yeah, Shelton. That. Yes, that's right. Uh, people nominated him as your sexiest man alive. Now, I'm saying that uh, one of the Astros probably could have taken that title, but let's toss to this video where he shows Adam Levine that he scored the title. This is a great source of pride and I win. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Take off the blindfold. Just, just peek. What? Look how sexy. That, read that. That says sexiest man alive, which means I am the sexiest man that's living right now. Man, I'm proud of you, buddy. That Aww. is hilarious. <laughs> now, you know, Adam did he have was... that title in 2013. Right, right. So he's kind of razzing him there. But Blake told the magazine that they must be running out of people. So oh, one other thing he admits is that he has gout, and he doesn't understand why he's the sexiest man alive. Hey, before oh, we let you go, by the way, you're headed out to L.A. for the AMAs this weekend. As huh? soon as I leave here, I'm going backstage to the AMAs when they rehearse for the show, and I'll get to speak to them one-on-one. -on -one. So listen to me on KRBE uh. Friday and Saturday after afternoon to hear that backstage gossip. I love, love it. We will be tuning in. And if you would like to tune in, be sure to tune it to 104.1 KRBE. You can also uh, keep up with Special K on social media at Radio Special K. He is, as a reminder, on the radio weekdays from 6 to 10 a.m. Yes, on the sir. And Ryan show. Thanks, Thanks guys. so much for stopping Thanks. by. Thanks. Safe Good travels. You, Can't wait to hear all the gossip when you come back. Of course, the holidays.